Okay, I'm going to do a quick lesson here to show you how to download the Contest Burner plugin, install it, and then show you some of the basic options that it has. Now, the first thing here we are is on the Contest Burner website. And you know, you just at the top here, you've got the download link. You just click on download, it'll take you to this page here. Just click on download the plugin here, and it's going to ask you if you want to save it or what you want to do with it. You can just save your save the file. And you'll have to choose where you want to save it to. And in my case, Firefox has a default download folder that it saves it into. So I had to go find that folder, which I'll bring that in here so you can see that here. But you'll have to figure out where on your computer you downloaded the plugin. Because in the next step, you're going to need that. So once you've downloaded the plugin and saved it on your hard drive, you'll have something. Uh, called contestburner.zip, which is a zip file. It's a um, a file that's been compressed down um, into a uh, uh, kind of zipped up and shrunken file. Um, and we're going to use that here. So once you've downloaded it, you need to log into your WordPress installation. And you can see here, this is the uh, WordPress dashboard. And uh, once you've done that, you're going to need to go to your plugins uh, links you just click on plugins and you'll see here add new click on add new then you'll see right up here under install plugins one of the options here is upload now we can browse to where the plugin is installed on or where you downloaded the plugin on your computer okay then once you've found it here's where it is on my computer you just select open then you click the install now button so once you've clicked that, you can activate the plugin, and then you'll see it in your plugins panel here. You'll see it active. And right here, there's Contest Burner, and it's currently listed as an active plugin. Now, Contest Burner itself, um, if you need support at any time, there's a, a few links both here from the um, in the plugins tab here. You can click right here where it says uh, Business Inner Circle. You can click on that and go to our help forum at any time. Then also in the Contest Burner menu itself, which once you've activated the plugin, you'll see it down here in this area right here. You now have a whole settings um, for running contests. And there's a couple things that you're going to need to do in here. And the first is, is doing your settings. So with Contest Burner, there's a couple things here. Um, I'll have to gray this out so you cannot see the license key. But um, there's a couple things that you can do here. One is if you've upgraded to premium, you can paste your license key in right here. And then when you submit this page, it will activate all the premium features. So the, one of the things you can do here is um, allow points for comments. You can turn that functionality on, decide which comment contest it's going to go to. Now also here with Twitter, you can decide to tweet your contest standings out on Twitter, how often you want to do that. Um, and some of these features are premium features, so if they're not active on your installation of Contest Burner, it's because you haven't upgraded to premium. Um, next is uh, you can give people points for sending tweets out on Twitter. And you have to set that up and link Contest Burner with your Twitter account. And there'll be a button here you need to click to authorize Contest Burner to work directly with your Twitter account. And it uses the secure um, open authentication uh, method, which protects you so you don't have to give us your password. And the next thing is uh, then you have all the YouTube functionality here that you can turn off and on, assign points for each individual thing. Uh, if you're allowing people to win points for commenting on your YouTube videos, you paste your your video URLs right here. If you want to allow uh, points for video responses, you paste your YouTube videos, the links to them right here. And then you can set up the points and which contests they're good for. Now with the premium plugin, you can actually run multiple contests at the same time. And you can assign, um, you could have a, com a blog comments contest running and then uh, assign comment points to that particular contest. You could have a separate Twitter contest running and assign points to the, your Twitter contest. 
and even a separate YouTube contest. So you could run uh, as many contests as you want, theoretically, all at the same time with the premium version. So once you've turned all this, you know, activated the premium version, turned on all the settings you want, you just click the save button at the bottom and it will save all of your um, all of your settings.